name is Lynn. Hey guys, it's Lynn. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Hey guys, it's Lynn here. And uh, I hope everyone is having an absolutely amazing day. And before I get any further, I just want to give a massive, massive, massive thank you to you all because I've reached over 50,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. And I have to say, guys, I am really, really moved because never in a million years, when I started the channel seven years ago, I started off purely this little hobby, putting on videos here and there. Never in my wildest dream did I ever expect to get 50,000 subscribers. And um, I just want to thank you all. So, so this video is a big, big thank you to everybody for all of your support over the years. And also to all my new subscribers as well. And for subscribers that have been there from day one, thank you so much. Hi everybody. And congratulations, Lynn. You're awesome and wonderful and fantastic. It looks like the rest of the world is finally figuring out what I've known forever. I, you know, I knew that you were awesome. Um, I'm just so happy for you. What is it? It's just wonderful news. I mean, did I really see 50,000 subscribers? That's wonderful. Congratulations. You rock and you deserve it. This is a very, very short video. And if you don't know who Lynn Kimberly is in all of her different talents, I encourage you to look in the description of this video below um, and follow the links that I give you so you can learn all about her and why she would have a channel with that many subscribers. I mean, she's great at a lot of different things. Um, she's really good at lending healing energies as an um, actually giving therapy to human beings using crystals, but then she's also a gemologist. But then she's also this incredible green thumb. And Lynn, you know yourself better than I possibly could, but because of that, I know that you know that you're so much more than that. You're so much more than that. You're kind of like one of those tiny little pink and white blossoms. I don't know if you remember, I can never, I can never remember the name. It's a very special little cactus. It was one of my favorites that uh, used to feature on the channel a lot. It's very, very small. It's like maybe about this wide. It's kind of a round cactus. And there is a, it's sort of like a rounder circumference when you look at it from the top. It was potted and then it kind of comes to... Oh, Hang on one second. Hey, I'm back. So, uh, oh boy, had a little bit of a interruption, but um, that's okay. I was probably being a little long-winded anyway. Everything that you guys need to know about Lynn, you can check out from these links. But now I was talking about this one bloom that I remember from one of your smaller cacti years ago. Um, what I loved about this bloom is that this particular cacti it wouldn't like make lots of these blooms would make like one or just two and it looked kind of like um like a dwarf rose almost to me but then once it opened I realized there were more petals and it looked almost like a daisy it was mostly white and it had just these little touches of pink and that entire plant to me it's like when I think of you I think of that plant because it's so beautiful and it has so many different attributes and aspects <laughs> you know like you're a tough person you're a tough cookie just like how spiny a cactus is but there's so much more to you than that there's so much more to you than your resilience but in your resilience there's also this beauty and this sort of gentleness that's there. I don't know about you, and I think, I think you probably feel the same way, but I've always found cacti to actually have a really soothing effect. Being around them is really soothing. Somehow they make you feel soothed. I don't know why, they just do. And I think that you have that effect on people. And then also, of course, you already know that you're very pretty. But, um, there's something about being that excited about all these natural things and really grateful and happy to know of nature and to get to share that with people 
that in and of itself is a really beautiful thing, like that flower. And like that beautiful little cacti. I have to find that video now. Anyways, uh, I just wanted to say congratulations and see you guys later. Bye. So to get emotional. Anyway, um, I want to send you loads of love, heaps of happiness, and tons and tons of plant power from across the Emerald Isle. And until my next video, bye. Thank you all. Cup of tea now, huh? Yep.